Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a cheat code system in your very own Scratch game. Now this is a very, very easy thing to do, and you can use it if you want to, I don't know, test a game or something, and you just want to have a couple extra coins or points or whatever your currency system is. Let's get right into it. Alrighty, so let's say we want to get these points, but let's say if you get 100 points there's a reward, but in the game you don't want to control your character, I made this horrible game as a demonstration, you don't want to just keep controlling your character to get 100 points every single time for testing, that's not, that's not good, that would take forever and you won't be able to complete your game on time. So what we could do is take the flag, grab ourselves an if block, and we're going to use a code block that I never use at all. Username. <laughs> I never use this. I don't think I've ever used this. I've only used it one time to make a cheat code a long time ago. So let's say username equals, let's see my username, Romeo977 right here. R O M E O 977. So we got if username equals Romeo977, then we need to put whatever we want. In this case, change points by 100. So flag clicked, boom, 100 points. Now, I can't really show you this because I'm not going to create a new account just to prove a point, but um, this works every single time. If you name yourself like Romeo779, it's not going to work because it's if username equals, and username does not equal. Now, let's say you don't want to risk this. What if you're afraid that, let's say you have a username that's used a lot, you don't want other people to have it, you can do this. I'm going to do it right here. If username equals Romeo977, and we're going to do key, we'll do a key that no one uses a whole lot while you're playing a game. Something that you don't randomly click. Let's say, I don't know, key. You probably won't do that. So if I click start, I don't have 100 points. But if I click T, if I click T, if I click T, okay, I figured out the issue. This is a if Romeo equals 977 and key T pressed. So this isn't going to work because it's really hard to click T as soon as the game starts. So we're just going to do a forever loop. So we're going to, so if we make this change, it's going to increase our points by a lot. So forever how long we hold down T. <laughs> I love this. But let's make it a set too. We'll do set points to 100. That's what we wanted. So if username equals Romeo977, my username, and key T pressed, then set points to 100. Nothing's happening. So people are just like, oh, this cool game with absolutely no cheat codes whatsoever. I'm going to play this normally. I'm going to play this horrible, horrible game normally. But the creator of the game can press T and get a bunch of points instantly. So there we go. Now, there's always ways to make this cheat code more secure, I guess, so people won't find it. For example, you could do if T and what's a key? It's like really weird. Uh, are there numbers? Ha! Huh. Let's say if you do T and 7 at the same time, we got T7. Boom, points. I don't think anyone's gonna name themselves Romeo977. Hold down the T button and hold down the 7 button in the middle of playing a game. So that wraps up a really short 4-5 or five minute tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'm not going to do any of that horrible subscribe or else the spider will be in your bed tonight. Because that's weird and I'm not going to do that. So bye.